Hi, I'm Lachlan from Kashi, and this is Aaron's Hyundai Elantra, named Cecilia. Before we jump into the main part of our review, here's our one sentence recap. Cecilia is like Chicken Little. You don't expect much from her, but she keeps on clocking. First off, the drivability. While you might not believe it, Cecilia is better in this department than you'd expect. She's not necessarily sporty, and she definitely isn't quick, but she'll get you going. In the drivability category, Cecilia scores a 6 out of 10. On to practicality and the full size bob test. But first, a little note. This has got the most annoying thing on any modern car. A boot without a button. You have to use the key fob or the button inside to unlock the boot. Absolutely frustrating. Bobby? In your hop. Eight out of ten. If you want to talk about features, Cecilia's got them for days. And by days, we mean she's got none. She comes with a radio and an AC. Not bad. How'd you get there? Well, Cecilia does have a working AC, and she's got a couple of features. So in my books, gives her a 6 out of 10. In the engine bay, oil comes out the bottom and it goes back in the top. As far as service and common problems go, there's almost nothing better than a Hyundai. There's only a few common problems on these. They rattle a little bit when they're cold. They have a uh, knock in the steering column. And they need a timing belt every 90,000 Ks. Pretty pricey expense. If we're talking about common problems, Cecilia does have a couple. But she's a dream to work on, which means she's a 6 out of 10 in my books. Just like Cheryl, Cecilia doesn't have isofix, which is some pretty serious down points. But in the full-size kid test, she ranks pretty high. That's Aaron. Yep. In the kids and comfort category, Cecilia scores reasonably well. 5 out of 10. Overall, Cecilia the Hyundai Elantra scores 31 out of 50 putting her easily on top of Cheryl from last week. Thanks again, I'm Lachlan from Cashy.